Well, morning campus is 17th of May. It's uh, 10 28. I didn't get up till quite late this morning, gone eight o'clock. Um, I'm in the woods, uh, I don't know what it's called. Um, halfway down what we call Haywood Strait. I come from Westbury to Trilby, I'm on the right hand side. Uh, I might have to get up and have a little mooch about in a minute and uh, see what's going on. Well, anybody who's interested in this park up, there's a road, and it's like this. But they have, it was really tight on this fence, but they've taken the fence down along the back there now. And they've um, made it deeper and easier to park. So, no parking on this side, access required for timber lorries. So, you get timber lorries in here, but I've not seen any. But there's footpaths both sides. Not really, uh, I don't know if you go through there, you come to Cattle Lane. Discover blue bells in weird life and butterflies. It's quite a clanger wood. Oh, yeah, it's clanger wood near Picket Wood, the other side, isn't it? What's the walks? Quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. Need to see what's going on. It looks nice. Well, here are folks. I'm at the uh, Friday night park up. But as you'll know, it's only Wednesday. Um, done some bits and pieces. I don't know if you noticed. Uh, I've revitalised the front of the van. They're all a bit, uh, bit patchy. Look. Looking good, though, isn't it? It's beautiful now, and it's growing. Well, I stayed in um, Clanger Wood last night. I was going to um, go up to. I went up through and got some gas this morning. Um, went into the petrol station, got some diesel in Asda and Froome. Just letting you have a look around, a little bit quiet. Yeah. You know, if you've got tomorrow night, we're going out with the lads tomorrow night. And um, I'm not sure who's going. But uh, little Skins' car has broke down. So I'll make me own way in the van and park in the car park. And the skin said that's good because this is growing. Look lush. Yeah, so I use Skin, I use Toby's works van, so Skin and Toby can get there. But the only thing is, is one of them won't be able to drink. Could be driving. But that won't apply to me, because uh, I shall um, stay in the car park as usual. I was going to go over to, um, what do they call it? What do you call it now? I was going to go over to, um, so I was looking there, I, I backed into something earlier on and I think I had the rubber bun because we, since I wore my bumpers, I've been cleaning all my bumpers. Um, me, yeah, uh, but reversing bleeper is only working intermittently. It's quite, it's quite good being up here and no wind. Uh, hey ho! I got a clue what the time is. Yeah, I said, I don't know, I was gonna go up the round way. Go get some gas in the visor, go up the round way, because we're going to the valley tomorrow night. And um, that's only a problem, so it's just down the road. But then I thought, it looks on the thing, it looks like it's gonna be cloudy tomorrow. So what I've done is I parked, come there. Try to park up. 
Um, yeah, come to Friday Night Park Up, and I don't have to go through town from here because I can go here and go left. I think it's not fucking sure, is it? Not Kruker and Shooter, Kruker and Chittern, and cut across. Oh, just cut across the plane. The good devices from the back. Oh. And I thought to myself, if it's going to be dull tomorrow, at least I'll get a bit of a, a bit of a um, bit of sun, a bit of solar, and charge me thing up. But I like it up here anyway. Beautiful, peaceful. I want that peaceful today because fucking tractors ring up and down. And some bloke was up here to pick up. And he was on the phone. So what he was doing. Well he worked up here or done something up here. Or he was scoping it out to go up, come up here and dump something or what. I don't know. Make sure he could get out the bottom end. I don't, I don't know. But he, the truck was empty. Um, yeah. 90% sure the van sold. The ambulance is sold. Um... It's a bit open, really. But... I think it's sold. But will there... How the deal's going? Are we taking a part exchange or not? I haven't got a clue. Um, put it on eBay to sell the part exchange. So if that sells, then it'll be a cash deal. And if it don't, we'll be having a part exchange. So um, not much, not much going on there. That's a deal done, I think. I mean, I got a bloke coming up from Northern Campers to buy this. And he said he was going to be there today. But he would, no, well, the bloke that rang me last week said he would be there Monday. Then the bloke rang me Sunday and said he couldn't be there Monday, he wouldn't be there till Wednesday. So what I've done is I parked up sort of quite close to Wednesday. And he rang me and he said, oh, he said I'll be there at one, about one o'clock this afternoon. I said, you're too fucking late, mate. I said I've already gone on my travels. So um, you'll have to reschedule. I still want to buy it. You'll have to reschedule. But I don't know what they're offering me. But I mean, well, I do know what they're offering me. He said he's offered me 26 grand for it blind. But he ain't fucking having it for that. You know, I mean, one last year I put two and a half. Well, just over, because I already had some of it. But just over two grand's worth of fucking electric. I just paid 1400 pounds with two lithium batteries. But um, he ain't having that. I'm mean, gonna put, I'll pull all that out. Cause that's a good thing about it is I could take the batteries out because it's got the battery to battery charger and the ordinary charging system in it, and they run parallel. So basically, by taking all the Victron stuff out, I'll leave the original stuff in untouched and just put an original hundred amp hour gel battery back in. Gel battery or a fucking see what that see what that said it was but um i'm not sure i want to sell it anyway you know where'd you get another one from because this is all sorted out and it's only done sort of 70 odd thousand miles um so i think i'll keep it but i don't know depends what you offer me if he offers me if I see something advertised and he offers me some silly, well, not silly money, money I want for it, then he can have it. But, I mean, I think if he offers me 32, I'll sell it. Maybe. It's almost fucking sure, see? <laughs> yeah. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Anyway, folks, I'm getting a bit tired. I'm just rambling on, really tired. I'm sorry I haven't done any videos, but I just haven't been fucking... I just can't be bothered. Nothing's really happened. And, I, and I'm, when I'm working hard, or when I was working on doing these plastics on here to get these back right again, you know, I can't fucking do that and do cameras, do film it. It just doesn't want anything. 
Oh, it's different when H is about, when she's about. I mean, she'll do, do a bit of camera in, I'll do a bit of camera in, so it ain't too bad. But she won't be about until um, June, May, was it May 15th? A couple of weeks, maybe three weeks, and she'll be about for a couple of weeks, and then she'll go, then she's going to a wedding, then she's going back north again. So, um, hope to see her. Hope to see her down then. But uh, all depends on where, because he looks after his dad, not literally, like, whether he goes to the doctor's or whatever, whatever appointments he got to, whatever she's about. So we all sort of fit around her schedule, which ain't a problem. Um, yeah. Yeah, if that ambulance goes and we haven't got a trade in, and that's, I think she'll be done about the 4th of June. The fourth, all like that, fifth, it's not that. And then she's got to go to the wedding on the seventeenth, so she'll be gone for on the fifteenth or the sixteenth. So that's all but a fortnight, isn't it? Well, not a fortnight, ten days, isn't it? Is it ten days? Yeah, she comes on the fifth and goes on the fifteenth. That's ten days, isn't it? So it'd be nice to come down here, go down the coast and travel or do something. Um, I want to go down a new key, really. Because I got um my uh, van since I changed the ECU. When you boot it, which I don't do very often, it gives black smoke. And sometimes when it's when you're going really low in the gears, it will puff a little bit of black smoke. But it's all to do with the um, other ECU was burnt that bad. They couldn't get quite get the map of it properly. So um, they said they made the bits up. They couldn't do. Actually, fucking flies. You know, it goes well. But, um... Yeah. I'm just trying to think. What other news is there? And one mate, Ali, she sent me a photograph this afternoon. Well, was odd not. Never sent me a photograph. I saw on the internet. She went out a tattoo done this morning. Or tattoo done the day, I presume. Um... Yeah, I can't really think. Um, yeah. I drove in. Yeah, went up fucking... <laughs> talking away this morning on the phone. Went to pull out the bloody... The thing to turn up to go towards... Um, devices. Of course, they sent me Tom Tom for fucking free. Well, not send me Tom Tom for free. Sent me Tom 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 on the Friday night park up, and I. So when I come out, turn me fucking left, and I thought, oh, bollocks, this is like he's just got a free. Uh, where the Westbury? Um, came up through Westbury, and I thought I saw our brother in his fucking Mini Cooper. But, and I followed him, he went in the Mar Morrison's, so I thought to myself, well, I can't see why he's in Westbury, and I can't see why he's in fucking Morrison's. But I followed this fucking bloke around the car park and um, he was his little... He, Claire Brother got one of them fucking girly fucking minis as a Cooper but got like a, a bubbly top on it, like a black top. Like it's old English white with like a blacky top on it. Looks a bit fucking... Well, it's all right, I suppose. He's had it three years, he reckons it's all right. Um, Yeah, but it wasn't him. And, uh... Yeah, I went through him. Got myself some gas. Um... Went down to. I well, went and seen Rob and given the log books. I sold. I sold me bloody, me monkey bike. Come back to Corsley. Uh, maybe sell a cup of coffee. Did a bit of video in. Well, not a bit of video in. Bit of fucking played a few games, and then come up here. I got something to tell you, lot. I can't fucking think what it is. Um, I don't know what it is. The bloody colour of these skies in this sort of bluey, grey, whatever is nice. Anyway, I'll leave it at this and I'll speak to you later. Remember, stay classy, no fighting, love you all. Bye bye. Nice speech, you day skins. And you skins. <laughs>